It's time for Blueprint, where we look at successful and savvy entrepreneurs, fresh ideas, and businesses that have taken off. You've heard of lawyers and accountants billing by the hour, but bankers do it now, too. That is, if they work with Accordion Partners. Accordion is a temp agency for investment bankers. I sat down with the co-founder and CEO, Nick Leppard, and I asked him for more details on how his company runs. We work really like a law firm, where people can use us by the hour, either five hours a week, or I've got a live deal and I need someone for the next three months. Do you find that it's hard to fight a prejudice from, from the client side? I mean, as you say, people are used to hiring lawyers by the hour. They're used to hiring accountants by the hour. Mm -hmm. Is there some sort of cliche that investment banking is all about relationships, and how can you have that if you're paying by the hour? There's no doubt that that is uh, still true, and actually, we really support that, that thesis. Our people are really the analysts, associates, and VPs. So you would never temp out somebody for a relationship standpoint or to go out and, uh, and call on potential investors. But the real workhorses in a deal that are doing all the financial modeling, doing the industry research, or drafting up an investor presentation, that's what we do. So we're really the behind the scenes, you know, somewhat mercenaries in a deal. How does this work? There's a really dramatic change going on within the financial services industry. Investment banks really want to avoid the overhiring and over firing of uh, the past cycles. And look, the community's coming back. There's deal flow. Um, we see it right now with all our clients. But they're, they're really hesitant to make full-time hires. I think there's a big shift in the hiring practices. So, Nick, you mentioned M&A is coming back, and it certainly is. I mean, yep. 2010 was stronger than a lot of people expected. I want to ask you almost a counterintuitive question. If M&A business gets better, yes. are banks more likely to keep their own investment bankers in-house and not worry so much about the cost of hiring or the cost of carrying a bigger investment banking staff? Um, no doubt. Hiring is going to come back, and you know, as more deal flow comes in and more uh, more fees come in, they're going to look to bring on full time staff. But I think there's still some which would hurt your business. Increased deal flow actually helps our business. The, we have a major client that has a um, on their equity capital markets desk has one of their associates leave on maternity leave. You know, they could very easily just stretch the uh, the current employees even further. But with all the increased deal flow, they still need to bring us in for four to five months while that professional's on maternity leave, and they're not jeopardizing talent. Who's the average person, though, in your database? Is there a kind of profile that you find to be typical? Typically, it's, it's a three- to seven-year professional um, out of a bulge bracket bank or out of a top-tier private equity fund, and they're sort of looking for a new way to work in finance. Personally, I always loved working, uh, working on deals, but I did not love the idea of being chained to a desk 90 hours a week, regardless. Which is so, typical. Which is absolutely typical. Um, and this is a new way to work in finance. I think this generation ha is so used to being involved in so many activities from the time you're five years old, you know, going to music, going to yeah, athletics. Yeah, want a little quality of life somewhere in there. Absolutely. Or just diversity of work. Hey, I want to expose you to a lot of different management teams, or I want the flexibility to pick and choose the assignments I work on. A little bit on the changing face of Wall Street there from Nick Leppard. He is the founder, co-founder, and CEO of Accordion Partners.